Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to What's in the Box. I'm Jared, and I'm taking you on an adventure. And today, sponsoring our adventure is Think Outside Box. Think Outside Box is a kid slash young adult adventure outdoors box. Not only trying to get kids outside to play and experience the world, the company itself is are helping create more socially aware children, which is amazing. The theme for this box is night, uh, as you can see with all the stars and, and all that stuff on this outside. From the previous boxes, these are great boxes for kids to experience and, and learn, and uh, I've yet to be disappointed with anything that has been, come in these boxes. So let's, uh, let's open night and see where the stars fall. Your night box. This is the pamphlet that has all the literature and the fun facts and the information about the products. Uh, it also comes with a, a little challenge sheet to give you ideas and things to do outside. Obviously at night, kids get your parents' permission or help, preferably help. So we have a, looks like a little uh, kinetic controlled flashlight. I don't want to shine in the lens, but I will. Warm JJ. Got a little LED on there. So you can lock it in with that switch so it stays, if you don't want the handle jutting out on you. You can charge it up and, and have, so you always have a flashlight and you don't have to rely on batteries. Awesome at night. The only thing I would like to see on this is a red filter. Like if you're doing stargazing stuff, you want the red because the blue light can be harsh to your night vision. That's just a preference. We have a tactical glow-in-the-dark beaner, carabiner. The glow-in-the-dark carabiner, which is great. Uh, I can't tell you how many things I've lost outside at night because uh, I didn't have a flashlight. But a glow-in-the-dark carabiner is great. Like you put your keys on this and you're out hanging out and the sun goes down. No crap, can't find my keys. I can't get inside. Pretty solid. I don't know that I'd hang too much weight from this, but it's a great little attachment. Even just night hiking to have a glow-in-the-dark thing on your bag to, to stand out. So we have a LED headlamp, which is great for doing stuff around at night and you need your hands free. I use these in work a lot. So basically, this will this will pop up on your head here. You'll pull the straps around the back. And it's it's on a pivot, so you can you can you know look where you're looking, so you can see where you're looking, uh, and you're not never completely in the dark. Great for reading maps on a hike or if it gets cloudy. It's a good thing to have in your bag at all times. It's a great multi-purpose tool. We also have a stargazing learn and live card set, pocket companion knowledge guide, and this one is obviously for stargazing. And we have some of the the more pronounced and well-known constellations in here. Uh, it gives you tips on how to see them, where to look in the night sky for them. Really cool if you're into stargazing uh, or into space or astronomy. And we have a reusable nylon Velcro strap. These are great. Hiking with headphones or something, you can loop it through here so it's not like dangling in your way. So multi-purpose. It's a great, great little tool. Finally, we have the Think Outside book, book itself with activities. We've got uh, night sky facts here. We've got the spotlight on Mammoth Cave National Park, which is an amazing National Park, if you get an opportunity to go to it. The social awareness look, like I said, they like to build social, con socially conscious children. It's is one of the best things you can do in this world. Puzzles, jumble, crossword, information about nocturnal animals, night hiking, phases of the moon, goes into light pollution, which is a thing that's actually very near and dear to me. Uh, I have a background in astronomy. Activities you can do with the flashlight, like treasure hunt, flashlight tag. We played flashlight tag growing up. Practice Morse code. If you go back to your first box, they had information in there on how to learn Morse code. So you can use this to practice and implement what you've learned and information about what's in the box. So that's Think Outside Box, a uh, really awesome box. I love the idea of marrying science and social awareness and outdoor exploration together as a company. Good job. You can learn more about Think Outside Box by visiting the link below. Use the code CONQUEST10, get $10 off your first order. That's, uh, that's it for me, I'm Jared. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, tell everyone you know. Uh, and I'll see you next time. But before we go, I have one question for you. How do solar systems plan a surprise party? They plan it. <laughs>